What's up everybody? How's everybody doing? Uh, this has been, it is the 3rd, January 3rd. I hope your New Year's went well. Um, so, you know, New Year's, New Year's Eve was an interesting day because we really wanted to see Cincinnati beat Alabama. That didn't happen. We wanted to see Michigan beat Georgia. That didn't happen. But on the plus side, on uh, Ohio State ended up beating Utah, which didn't seem like that was going to happen. So I guess one for three is, well, 33%, but not the best. But anyways. So it's uh, the U the NCAA uh, BCS Championship, if that's what you still want to call it, will be Alabama and Georgia for a rematch. So I don't know how I feel about that. It's, you know, it kind of stinks that... It, you have to see that see that all over again but if I had to pick one I would have to say go Georgia because Alabama is just they, they win all the time and I'd like to see somebody different win it so Georgia for the win for the BCS championship other than that there really hasn't been much going on it's just been you know one of those things that you know the, over the past week with the holidays and um, I did not eat very well with my diet, I will admit that, because I just basically, I mean, I didn't go hog wild, but I did have some cookies, and I had some different things, and I ended up going a little off the wagon, and eating things that I probably shouldn't have eaten, but it is what it is, it happened, and it's going to jump back on the bandwagon and see where it goes from there. I got my diffuser running over there and I've got Snow Day from reviving it. So speaking of diffusers and essential oils, I don't know how many people out there that are subscribed to me use essential oils, but I typically will use oils that are kind of woodsy smells, um, like tree scents, frankincense. What else do I have? Like wintery types type blends. I kind of stay away from the florals and stuff like that, but it's one of those things for. I've got quite a few different oils over there. I'll use like things that help you sleep at night, like lavender, but uh, masculine scents pretty much. But uh, yes, I use essential oils. I actually like them. Um, I know some people. You know, it's a lot of it's primarily female-based or female-driven. If you go on YouTube and set, type in essential oils, you're going to get a lot of females. But me personally, from a male perspective, they're very positive and very uplifting as well. But I tend to gravitate more towards, like, the outdoorsy type scents, like pine trees and Douglas fir. And uh, let me see what else I have over here. Let's take a look. Let's see here. Lemon and lime. I have uh, eucalyptus. That's a good one. Douglas fir, cypress, citrus bliss. You know, more citrusy type things. And uh, frankincense. That's a really good one. Uh, let me see frankincense. Put the frankincense there. This is a little bottle, but it's uh, Douglas fir. This one's really good too, it's a uh, wild orange. Then of course you can never go wrong with peppermint. Of course lime. Now this one right here, this really smells good. It's a Christmas spirit, that smells really good too. But I typically will go towards like, you know, like the woodsy stuff. And I got some more down here. Like, uh, there's Palo Santo and that kind of thing like that. Um, I will typically go with those kind of blends like that. So yeah, so that's typically what my essential oils are. And then of course, this is my diffuser. This is a Young Living Aria. And it is currently doing a snow day, which has a really good smell to it. So that's a typical 
day as far as diffusing. I mean, I diffuse oils constantly, honestly. If I'm awake, I usually have something in there. And if I'm not diffusing something, then that's pretty much it. So, yeah. So this week has been, you know, New Year's and Christmas are over. And I hope you guys uh, have a decent Christmas and you have a happy New Year. And this will be coming off because I can't stand it. But if you like this video, hit like, share, and subscribe. And uh, I will see you in the next one. Peace.